Moving recently started airing and we're already head over heels in love with the cast, but did you know that their romantic relationships in real life are much more interesting? We'll start off with one of the leads of the drama, the 52-year-old Ryu Sung Ryong. When you're speaking of actors with successful careers, his name should be one of the first to come to mind. Did you know that Sung Ryong is the first Korean actor that managed to bring in over 10 million viewers with four different films? As of right now, he's probably most known for being the male lead in the 2019 movie Extreme Job, which became Korea's second highest grossing film of all time. Although Seong Ryong has over a decade of acting experience and is considered to be one of Korea's top actors, there's not much we know about his personal life. He's been active in the industry since forever, but he's never made any of his relationships public. It's also remarkable that he's been in the midst of little to no dating rumors, despite having such a lengthy career. He's obviously been in relationships before. He even hinted at this in an interview for his film, Perhaps Love. He shared that working on a movie that is centered around romance made him look back on his past relationships. Other than that, he's way too secretive and private about his love life. Now on to Han Hyo Ju, who plays the role of Mi Hyun. She turned 36 this year, but she honestly looks like she's still in her early 20s. Not only is she absolutely stunning, she also happens to be multi-talented. From acting, to singing, and even modeling, she really does it all. She gained lots of attention for her role in W2 Worlds, and her performance in the movie Cold Eyes also had viewers in a chokehold. She's been acting for quite some time now, but her dating life is still a bit of a mystery. She likes to keep a low profile, and as of right now, it's assumed that she's single. Because of her stunning visuals and amazing chemistry with all of her co-stars, she's become the center of dating rumors many times. The first time she made headlines was in the early 2000s, when people suspected she was seeing fellow actor Lee Sung Gi. The two starred together in Brilliant Legacy and seemed to be very close, so people believed something was going on. The rumors were shut down quickly as the two were really just very good friends. A few years later, when Hyo Ju was starring in W2 Worlds, the public was convinced she and Lee Jong Suk were an item. The two had amazing on-screen chemistry and were also very comfortable around each other in real life. They even said they were each other's ideal type during an interview, so of course viewers were suspecting they were more than friends. These rumors went on for a while, but nothing was ever confirmed between the two. Her third alleged lover was another co-star, and this time around no one other than Kang Dong-won. This rumor had a bit more evidence as the two were photographed together in America. They were walking side by side as Dong-won was carrying a shopping bag, and netizens were convinced they were seeing each other. However, their agencies were quick to deny these allegations by claiming that their schedules just happened to overlap. They were both in the US, so they decided to have a friendly meal together. The last colleague Hyo Ju was linked to is Pak Hyung Sik, who was her co-star in the 2021 drama Happiness. The two looked great on screen together, so dating rumors were pretty much inevitable. Although all of this was just speculation, who knows what actually went down behind the scenes. Someone who's really intrigued the public is the 25-year-old Lee Jung Ha. He's not starred in that many dramas yet, but you might remember him from his role in Nevertheless. Luckily, he's been gaining more and more attention for his part in moving. Did you know that he gained around 30 kilograms to play the role of Kim Bong Sok? He spoke up about the journey and said, As I gradually gained weight, I wanted to become Bong Seok as soon as possible, and the more I gained, the more I could see him. The process of gaining so much weight sounds very tough, but he actually really enjoyed it. He had some worries though, as he shared, I was worried because my body got heavier after gaining weight, but after losing it, I became lighter and felt healthy because I exercised while adjusting my diet. Although he's not been in the acting industry for that long, there's no denying that he takes his job very seriously, and we can't wait to see what else he has in store for us. If you're eager to find out more about his love life, unfortunately, we have to disappoint you. Since he's newly stepped into the limelight, he hasn't shared much about his private life. Go Yoon Jung is yet another cast member that has a very strong grip on the public at the moment. Although she's only 27 years old, she's achieved quite a lot by now. If you've seen her performance in Alchemy of Souls, you know she has the skills to captivate an entire audience with her visuals. Even though she's never shared any information on her dating life, fans of Alchemy of Souls strongly believe that there's something going on between her and Lee Jae Wook, who plays her love interest. The two met for the first time on the set of the drama back in 2022. Ever since, they've taken the internet by storm with their closeness off-screen. Whether it's in an interview or in behind-the-scenes footage, the two aren't afraid to show the world that they're really close. Their interaction actions on Instagram also make people believe that they might have actually developed feelings for each other. Yoon Jung recently posted a picture of a clover and tagged Jay Wook in the picture, showing off their closeness. Although their drama's network loves showing them off as a couple, it's not been confirmed that they're seeing each other. For now, she's still single, but that might change very quickly. Next up is the 24-year-old Kim Do-hoon, who plays the role of Kang Hoon. Just
Just like Jung Ha, Do Hoon hasn't been in the industry very long. He starred in a few projects here and there, but none of his roles made him stand out like his part in moving. He shared his excitement of playing the part and said, I've always had a great passion for stories involving superpowers and heroes, and I had always dreamt of acting in such a project. What's even more touching is that Do Hoon read the script of the drama multiple times, even before the casting was announced, because he had such a great desire to become part of the cast. Luckily, his dreams came true, and to really embody his character fully, he even had to learn Taekwondo. The staff working with Do Hoon shared that he really put in all of his effort to give viewers the best version of his character. He'll definitely be landing roles left and right now that he's left such a good impression in the industry. When it comes to his love life, there's not much we know. At the beginning of your career, it's important to keep a low profile, and that's exactly what he's doing. Another cast member with an incredibly lengthy career is the 43-year-old Kim Soong Kyun. In moving, he plays the role of Kang Hoon's father. Soong Kyun actually began his career in theater, but then quickly made his screen debut in 2012. He's starred in tons of dramas and films over the years, with his most recent appearance being in DP. Not only is he very lucky in his professional life, it seems like he's also hit the jackpot love-wise. Soong Kyung has been happily married to his wife since 2010. His wife is a stage actress, so being in a similar field of work probably really helped their relationship. His wife really isn't the jealous type either, since Soong Kyung once jokingly revealed that she said she feels bad for anyone who plays his love interest. He seems to be very dedicated to his family, as he shared that he even considered quitting acting completely after he tied the knot to his wife. Luckily for his fans, he decided to stick around a little longer. The two now have three children, and the story of how their third child came to be is actually really funny. Back in 2015, Sung Kyung had voiced his wish for another child, and said that if his movie We Are Brothers would hit four million sales, he'd have another baby. He stayed true to his promise, and now they're one big happy family. Last on the list is Zo In Sung, who plays the role of Bong Sok's father. He turned 42 this year, and he's still as active as ever. He stepped into the limelight in the 90s, so of course his filmography is absolutely huge. He's most known for his roles on the big screen and actually hasn't starred in any dramas up until now. Despite being in his 40s, it's assumed that In Sung is single. Nowadays, he tends to keep a low profile because he once dated one of the most controversial actresses and that definitely made headlines. That's right, we're talking about his relationship with Kim Min Hee, who he was seeing back in 2013. Dispatch shared pictures of the two together, so they had no choice but to confirm their relationship. Reportedly, they met through a jeans commercial they did together in 2001. Unfortunately, the two called it quits after a year and blamed their busy schedules. Ever since, In Sung has mostly been enjoying the single life. He once explained that his celebrity image might put pressure on whoever he's seeing, which makes it harder for him to meet new people. In Sung once shared he didn't understand women enough to be in a relationship, but hopefully that has changed by now. How are you enjoying moving so far? Let us know in the comments and thank you for watching, and we'll talk to you soon.